हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू सॉल्व दिस नाइस मैथ ऑल ऑफ बेडल जबरा प्रॉब्लम सो हियर वी हैव स्केयर रूट ऑफ टू माइनस वन टू दी पावर ऑफ एट एंड वी नीड टू सिंप्लीफाई दिस जबरा का एक्सप्रेशन विदाउट यूजिंग द कैलकुलेटर सो इट्स मींस दैट वी विल शो ऑल ऑफ द वर्किंग ऑन दिस पेपर आई होप सो यू लाइक दिस मैथड बट इफ यू हैव एनी अदर मैथड इन योर माइंड सो प्लीज डोंट हेजिटेट टू राइट दिस मैथड इन द कॉमेंट सेक्शन so here the very first step we are going to do is here first we take the base of this uh, equation this expression is equals to x and it is square root of 2 minus 1 so we put this base equals to x it means that uh, further we need to find the value of x to the power of 8 so here our target is first to find the value of x to the power of 8 so for this we need to simplify uh, this equation uh, so from here we move this minus 1 to the left hand side and it will become x plus 1 equals to square root of 2. And now here in the next step we need to take the scaling on both of the sides of this equation. So when you take scaling it will be written as x plus 1 whole square equals to square root of 2 and its whole square. So uh, now uh, here we can just apply the algebraic formula in the left hand side and we know that x plus 1 whole square equals to x square plus 2x plus 1 is equals to this 2 and this square root are gone and we get here 2 only. And now here in the next step we move these two values to the right hand side and it will be written as x square is equals to uh, this is plus 2x equals to uh, minus 2x and this is plus 1 becomes minus 1 and this is our plus 2. So that here we get our x square is equals to minus 2x and plus 1 and we call this is our equation number 1. So because we find uh, we solve this problem for the value of x to the power of 8 first uh, so that in order to uh, find x to the power of 8 here we need to take the square again on both of the sides. Uh, so when we take again square it will be written as minus 2x plus 1 whole square. So further in the next step we have this is x square and its whole square is equals to x to the power of 4. And here we apply the algebraic formula and you know that uh, x a plus b whole square equals to minus 2x square plus 2 times of uh, minus 2x into 1 plus 1 square. And now further in the next step uh, we have minus 2 square equals to plus 4 and x square equals to x square. And this is 2 times of 2 becomes minus 4x and this 1 square equals to 1. So this is our x to the power of 4. And now further in the next step uh, here we need to use equation number 1 here. So we have x to the power of 4 equals to 4 times of x square. Here we put the value of x square and the value of x square is that minus 2x plus 1. We put it here it will becomes minus 2x plus 1 and this is minus 4x and plus 1. So further we need a more simplifications and we multiply this 4 on both of these terms and it will be written as 4 times of 2 becomes minus 8x, 4 times of 1 becomes 4 and this is minus 4x and plus 1. So here you have minus 8x minus 4x equals to minus 12x and 4 plus 1 is equals to 5. And in the left hand side we have x to the power of 4. So because we solve this problem for the values of uh, x only so uh, for this uh, here we again take uh, uh, scaling on both of the sides of this equation. So we obtain x to the power of 4 and its whole square is equals to minus 12x and plus 5 and its whole square. And now here in the next step uh, in, in the left hand side we have this will becomes x to the power of 8 and here we again apply the algebraic formula so it will be written as minus 12x whole square plus 2 times of minus 12x into 5 and plus 5 square. 
so further in the next step we need more simplifications and again we have minus 12 square and we know that 12 square is equals to 144 but if you have the even power of negative base it will be equals to positive number so this negative sign become positive and this x becomes x square and this is 2 times of 12 becomes minus 24 x and it is multiplied by this 5 and plus this 5 square is equals to 25 and now here in the next step we again uh, put the value of x square here so it will becomes x to the power of 8 is equals to 144 into the value of x square is that minus 2x plus 1 and this is minus 24 times of 5 is equals to 5 4 is a 20 we write a 0 and carry 2 5 to the 10 10 plus 2 becomes 12 so 24 times of 5 becomes minus 120 x and at the last we have this is 25 so in the next step uh, here first we need to uh, multiply this 144 on both of these values so when you multiply this with this you get here uh, 288 minus 288 x and 144 times of 1 equals to 144 and this is minus 120 x plus this will becomes 25 so uh, here you have this is the value of x and now here we need uh, to add or subtract the like terms uh, so here we have we need to add 240 288 and uh, this is minus 120 so we need to uh, sum up these two values uh, so you know that uh, 288 minus 120 is equals to minus 408x and 144 plus 25 is equals to 169 so this is the value of uh, x to the power of 8 in terms of x so uh, here we back substitute the value of x as in the start of the problem we will take here our x is equals to square root of 2 minus 1 so when you put this value here it will becomes uh, at square root of 2 minus 1 to the power of 8 is equals to minus 408 into uh, the value of square root of 2 minus 1 uh, is when you substitute it here it will becomes square root of 2 minus 1 and plus 169 so now we multiply this value on both of these terms it will becomes minus 408 into square root of 2 and plus 408 and this is plus 169 so here we obtain minus 408 into square root of 2 and we add these two values uh, so uh, when we add these two values it will be written as 8 plus 9 becomes 17 we write 7 and carry 1 0 plus 6 is 6 6 plus 1 is 7 and 4 plus 1 is 5 so it will becomes 577 so this is the our final simplified form of the given question this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos